Hey there, if you have an older iPad and you're trying to install Netflix or Spotify or another app, you may see a message like this. This application requires iOS 17 or later. First thing you want to check is that the iPad is up to date software wise. So go to settings, then general and software update and check for an update. I know for a fact that this has been checked and the highest it can go to is 15.8.4 which is below that 17 that was told to us on this application requires iOS 17 or later error. So what we need to do to get around this is two things. Number one, we need another device which has an iOS which is higher than 17 and we need both devices to be signed in with the same Apple ID. So use the Apple ID from the iPhone on the iPad or the Apple ID from the iPad on the phone. If you're concerned with privacy and don't want to sign in to another device with your Apple ID, create a brand new one for this purpose. I'll leave a link in the description and you can sign into both with the new Apple ID. For this example, I'm going to use an Apple ID I've signed in on my phone with. So I'm signed in here and the first thing to do once signed in is go to the App Store. The first thing we'll do is download the app which we're trying to install on the old iPad. So we'll give this a moment to download. That's now downloaded. So what I want to do now is come out of the App Store, go to Settings and sign out of my current Apple ID here. I've just signed out and now it's time to sign in with the same Apple ID. Both devices are now signed in with the same Apple ID. So let's go back to the App Store. We'll remove that and let's click on Get. It wants us to sign in to complete the purchase. So I'll sign in once more. Now I've signed in, I have a new message saying, download an older version of this app. We'll go to Download and this will start downloading the Netflix app. And of course, if you want Spotify and other apps, simply repeat. Install it on the newer device first, then come across and install here. When it's all said and done, just sign out of the Apple IDs and go back to your regular ID on your iPad and on your iPhone. Let's just check that the Netflix app is installing. We'll click to open, and as you can see, it's ready to sign in.